Hey everyone, how's it going? In today's video, I'm going to show you a tutorial of how to install Minecraft Optifine 1.17 on Mac without Java. Okay, so first, what you want to do is go to this website, optifine.net forward slash downloads. Uh, there'll be a link in the description if you need it, and it'll take you to this page here. 1.17, they don't actually have an official release yet, but they do have preview versions, so you, you can download these when they come out. And the newest one, 325. What you want to do is click the mirror button here, and there we go. We're at this website here, and we've got to do click download. Now you see it's downloading there. Wait for that to complete, and there we go. It's done. So head back to our thing here, go to the finder, click downloads, and we'll see that this is here. So we just move this out onto the desktop so it's easier. So while we're in the finder, we're going to want to press Shift Command G and type this into the bar. Now, go to head down, look through this folder until you find Minecraft. Double click. Then you want to look for a folder called Runtime. Here, double click. And when you find this jre.bundle, right click and click show package contents. Now double click on this, go to home, bin, and you should find this folder here. Now you see we have Java already in this folder. This means that we do not need to download Java to open up this .jar file. So now we're going to want to go to the launch pad and type in terminal. We have terminal here. And this is what we're going to use to open it. Now, first we're just going to rename this file here to Optifine, just so it's easier. That's wrong. Now that we have that, put it in this folder here. Move. Now, right click on Java, hold the option key on your keyboard, and press copy Java as path name. Now we have that, we can go to this terminal and type in cd space quotation marks paste and then delete java off the end quote and press enter. Now we press quote paste quote dash j a r and then we're going to want to type the name of the file which is optifine.jar like that and hit enter. Now you see Java has opened it here and we just want to click install. There we go. That's installed. Now we can close the terminal, terminate, and we can move this to bin and close this off. Now when we open Minecraft, Click this here and you should see Optifine Pre-25. And there you go, now you have Optifine. Now we can just run this and play. And there we go, yeah. Now if Pre-25 doesn't work, because it doesn't work for some people, you want to go back to Optifine. And instead of downloading Pre-25, you want to download Pre-21. Now, uh, this one doesn't allow shaders, but it does work at the moment. And by the time in the future when the official 1.17 comes out, you can just follow the same steps, download the 1.17 one, and it will work. Now, if you have managed to get it to work with a version that does allow shaders, to apply them, you do. Just go into Options, Video Settings, and you'll see the button Shaders. If you're in Pre-21, this will be grayed out so you can't click on it unfortunately, but click shaders and if you want to add some, go to shaders folder and it will open up this folder here and then you can put whichever shader file you want in there. And then you can just apply shaders and it's all cool. So thank you for watching and I hope you enjoy it. And if you have any questions, feel free to leave anything in the comments.